Hello art friends, I'm Robin. We know the importance that yoga and meditation has on our well-being, but don't forget that we can get that same effect with our art practice. Today's art exercise is one that you can use when you need to surround yourself with a, a sense of peace and a sense of calm, and it's great for all members of your family. We're going to use the spiral symbol as we know that throughout history, different cultures and different religions have used spirals to create a soothing and meditative state. Now this exercise is what we call a process activity, which means it's all about the doing rather than focusing on the finished product. As we go through each module, please feel free to press pause at any stage so that you can do the exercise in your own time or you can work along with me. Now, you ready to join me? Right, let's get started. Now let's see what we're going to need. We've got our watercolour pans, watercolour brush, two fine liners, one thicker, one thin, some water, some paper cloth just to wipe our brushes and some A3 cartridge paper. Now we talked about that lovely flow that spirals can give us, so we're going to start I want you just to find a spot on your page and just do a spiral. Now without taking your pen off your page, find another space and do another one. And another. They can be big, they can be little, whatever. Don't overthink it too much, just enjoy that flow of finding a space and doing a spiral. Now I'm going to continue, so join me whenever you're ready and just continue finding a space on your paper for your spiral. a great time to practice your breathing. Pop some nice music on, grab a warm drink and just enjoy the flow of doing your spirals. Don't forget, if you're working along with me at any stage, you want to press pause and rejoin me another time, that's perfectly fine. My pen has not left my page. I'm just enjoying not thinking too much and enjoying the flow of that spiral action. Once you think you're finished with your thick fine liner, you might want to grab the thinner fine liner and find some spots to fill with that. Same idea, just leaving the pen on the page 
just finding some little places for our fine lines. Remember, this is what we call a process activity. It's about the doing. It's about creating a lovely sense of calm and a sense of peace in the action rather than the finished product. I think I've finished my spirals. I've just enjoyed that lovely flow that drawing without intention is giving us. We're going to use our spiral page to continue that theme of spirals and we're going to use our watercolour pan our watercolour brush, the water, and we're going to use our paper towel here. Now I'm going to just continue that lovely spiral, that lovely flow we get. Now I'm using my lots of water and to create our watercolour, I'm just popping some water in the pan, using the edge of my brush just to create some water. And I'm going to enjoy that flow of spirals but with the watercolour. Once again, round and round. If you want to make it darker, of course, you put less water. Lighter is more water. So just play and enjoy that lovely flow. As you're playing with your brush, you'll know that if you use the tip, you'll get very fine lines, and as you press down, you're going to get thicker lines. Just pushing and pulling with my brush to get different thicknesses of line, but enjoying that lovely flow of the spirals. Filled up all the spots, I think. There. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed that and I hope you were able to create that lovely sense of calm that working with spirals can give you. Okay? Look forward to seeing you again soon. <laughs>